Welcome back. I'm Monica from LA Parks. Today, I'm with Channel 35 and I'm gonna teach a butt and gut workout. What you'll need is your resistance bands, a light set of dumbbells, your yoga mat, water, and a towel. Let's get started with knee strikes in place. Now, as you're getting your fitness equipment together, do not forget to like and sh share today's workout on Facebook. Working off time versus reps, pace yourselves, take those breaks, adjust your resistance bands or dumbbells, or have that option of using no equipment at all. Perfectly fine here. Now, if you can, increase your range of motion and or pace. 15 seconds here. We're gonna go into hamstring curls, warming up the back of those legs. As you drive those knees up past the hips, you wanna lean back a little bit, brace into that core. Belly button to spine. Open up that heart chest. Butt kicks here. You got it. Keep the shoulders nice and relaxed. Breathe with me here, yes. Pick up that pace or range, yes? Low impact workout today. At any time, you need to kick it up a notch. Please do so. Finish off. 10 seconds. We'll go into side to side. Lunges, staying low. Nice and wide, so you're here. Stand up nice and tall. Toes, knees forward. Hips, butt back. Looking good. Fifteen seconds. Quick feet. Light on the feet. Ball to the feet. Get ready, ready. You got it. Bring it in. Quick feet. Rocking your fast. Kick up those arms. Give me that forward punch. Widen your leg stance. Get a little low. Yes. Breathe. Come on. 20 seconds here. You got it. Come on. Going into regular squats. Full range. Your range. Footwork. Bring it in. Slow it down, shake it out. Good job, all the way down. Tippy toes, calf raise to the top with those squats. Breathing in as you come down, exhaling at the top. Using your glutes and abs to lift. Wrapping up, we're down to our last 10 seconds. We'll make our way on the floor. Focusing on mobility. And then we'll begin. Good job, shake it out. Hydrate, towel off as often and as needed as you like, yes? All right, so we're gonna go into our cat-cow. You want the wrist, shoulder aligned. Knees underneath the hips. Round that back. Neutral, flat back, gazing up. Moving at your own pace. Cleansing breath, breathing into the nose. Excellent to the mouth. Checking in with your form, making sure that you're not sitting too far back. Your weight distribution is centered here. Exaggerate, pause if you need to. A few more here. Taking your time, two more, brace to that core. Really rounding, arching, gazing up. Good job, you're gonna come on to those forms. Rocking that plank, elbow, shoulders aligned. Core is strong. You're gonna lift that heel towards the sky ceiling. You wanna lift up just enough to really contract those glutes. If you need to modify this, knees to the floor. Yes, bring it back. 
Extend, lift and squeeze on the Y. Kick it up, step it up. Knees off the floor, yes. 15 seconds, you got it, come on. Really engage. Exhale to the mouth. We're gonna open up those hips. Good work. Last time each side. Coming back onto those hands. Big step forward, open up. Take it back into your plank. Opposite leg, big step forward. Back leg, knee to the floor, opening up here. You got it, come on. 15 seconds, take your time. If you need a pause, hold that stretch a little bit longer. Listen to your body, hold that stretch. Good job. When you're ready, ready. You're gonna go to child's pose, slight stretches here. Look at those fingers, toes gently rock side to side. All right, so flexing your options, using your band or your light set of dumbbells. Now let's just say you only have one heavy dumbbell, that's perfectly fine. Use that one weight. You can always adjust one dumbbell, both or none, yes? So for the squat exercise, I'm gonna do without the dumbbells, but I'll be utilizing the band for this one. Switch it up if you need to. Find that medium, not too wide, not too narrow, but just right to tap into those glutes. Full range, we're gonna come down, stretch, stand up nice and strong, really engaging those glutes, yes. Now check in with your stance. Toes, knees pointed the same direction. Poke them out just a little bit. Slow controlled movement. We're looking at about a two count down. Two count up. We're here for about 45 seconds. So your drill, 30, 45, 60 seconds for time. Yes, there'll be a tempo change, range, slight movement change along the way. So definitely pay attention and adjust if you need to. Yes. Can you drop those hips butt back a little bit deeper? Yes. Really pushing off, toes, heels. You are down to your last 10 seconds. Oh yeah, come on. Strength focus. Using those glutes and abs, two more. Last one. Good job. All right, take that band off to the side. Out of the way, we're gonna go on to our back. Good old fashioned crunches. Options here. Use one weight or none. Bend those knees, that lower back is on the floor. So you just wanna lift up just a few inches here. As you come up, you wanna exhale and squeeze in. Breathing with me here, you got it, come on. So every time you come up, you wanna brace that core. Think about bringing your belly button to your spine. Control on your return, yes. Finishing off, less than 15 seconds here. So let's just say you are rocking that weight with me. Before you take that break, if you can, just gently, carefully bring that weight to the floor and continue your crunches. I would like to call this kind of like a drop set, if you may hear. Otherwise, take that short break, come right back up. So when you're ready, ready, bring those knees into the chest. Gently rock side to side. Keyword is carefully. Make your way back up. All right, using that one weight, we're gonna go into walking lunges, incorporating an oblique exercise here. So once again, checking in with the weights, your equipment, 
both weights are really on the light side, adjust to one or none. Rotate here, nice and tall. As you rotate, think about same leg, same side. Sit into it, keep the weight nice and close to the body, yes. You want to exhale on that rotation. Exhale when you stand up nice and strong. 40 seconds here. Utilizing the space that you have. Perfectly fine if you are doing your standard forward lunges or reverse lunges, yes? Core is strong. Sticking with obliques and glutes. Give me two more here. Good job. So you're gonna take that weight carefully to the floor, bend those knees. Side to side here, lateral skis. As you drop to the side, really bring the arms towards the side or towards that back wall, yes? You can incorporate a little hop or just focus on staying low, taking out the hop. So while you're here, as you come up, you wanna push off a little bit more from that heel, activating those glutes, yes? Now, challenge. Increase your range on that rotation. Feel the abdominals work. You got it, come on. 20 seconds here. In place. Have fun if you have the space. Travel with me here. Good job, shake it out. Hydrate, tell off. Back onto your mat. At focus. The bottom half, the lower half here. Walk it a bit. Just your body weight. We'll incorporate a light weight a little bit towards the end of the workout. All right, drop in the hands, arms to the side. Lift the legs up roughly about a 90. You want to engage. Gentle lift, gentle rock. Same concept as your crunch. As you lift, you wanna squeeze in and breathe out. Flexing your options here. Stay here, otherwise add the upper body. Lift your shoulder blades off the floor, yes? Just under a minute here. Squeezing inward. Exhaling at the top, yes? Options on the legs, stay here roughly at about a 90. Lift straight up, drop at a 90. Think about making that footprint to the sky, ceiling here, yes. Just under 20 seconds, you got it, come on. Wrapping up, we're gonna flip over. Last two, one more, good job, rest. Bring those knees in, gently rock side to side if that feels good. Feel free to take that break if you need to. Being able to see me at the same time, utilizing that band once again, this time, it's gonna be opposite hand, opposite leg. So when I say opposite leg, I mean foot, right? So we're here, once again, still working for time. You're gonna hold that band with a sturdy grip, and you want the band on the foot in the middle here, yes? So we're gonna come all the way up, bring that knee into the chest, going into that full extension on that kick, yes? Control here, adjusting the hand to making it a little bit more challenging, in other words, 
you're going to walk your hand forward a little bit more to create that resistance or adjust that band by making it more challenging, yes? Just under a minute, we're going to hit the switches. Control here. Challenge while you are doing this extension. You want to keep the hips squared off. You don't want to transition into like a side plank, yes? Take your time. Breathing in as you come down. Exhale, extend. So you want the head and neck aligned with the spine. You got it. Come on. Wrapping up. Less than 30 seconds. So this is definitely one of those two firsts here. Bring that knee in. Full extension. You are working mainly the glutes, but you're also activating the abdominals, yes? You're working a whole lot when you implement any kind of plank action. One more. Good job. Other side. How are we doing? You're looking great, yes? Ready, ready, set up, create that resistance. And begin. Once again, it's gonna be just under a minute here. I'm always going to stress the head and neck align with the spine. It's very easy to drop. Keep that core engaged. Now's a good time to adjust the resistance, yes? Breathe with me here. Nice and controlled. You got it. Come on. Obliques coming up. We're going to come onto our forearms and rock the hips. Swing. Yes. Finish off. 20 seconds to go. Come on. Adjust that band, making it easier if you need to, versus stopping completely, yes? Reposition the body if it looks like you're about to transition into a side plank, yes? Two more. Full range, knee into the chest. Full extension. Strong, nice work. All right, child's pose, gently rock side to side. If you need to come up, shake it out, tell off. Take it, take it. Obliques, brace into that core. Elbow, shoulders are aligned. One more here and we'll come right back onto our feet, yes? So you're here, side, hips up, engage, side. Yes, begin. Quick in and out, 30 seconds. Check in, how's your head? Align with the spine. Yes, a few more, come on. Good job, when you're ready, ready. Sit back, carefully come up. We're gonna grab that loop band again. Now if you have a smaller one, you wanna adjust so that you can place that band on your thighs. Now if you don't have access to a band like this one, a flimsier one will still work. Yes, or use your dumbbells or that one heavy weight right in front of you, yes? Definitely the thicker the band <laughs> with the fabric, the heavier it is in terms of resistance, yes? So we're gonna travel side to side, so it's gonna be a squat Lateral move, nice and deep, stand up straight for four repetitions, yes? So we're gonna move four to the right, four to the left, chest is lifted, hips butt back. Take your time, looking good, come on. Now, let's just say, hey Monica, this is kinda easy. 
I have that lighter band. I don't have a heavy band. Do me a favor. Grab your weights, yes? We're here for a minute. We have time. Deep inhale. Exhale at the top, yes? Now challenge, if you are rocking that band on your thighs, take a wider step out, yes? Wider step out. Little extensions. Going back to abs in about 20 seconds. Option, with or without your weight. Looking good, come on. Goals, keep that torso upright, yes? Try not to slouch forward, breathing in. Excelling at the top, yes? Bring it back, come on. Last few seconds. Two more reps. Good job. Woo. And off. All right, lighter weights. Both weights if they're light or none. Full abdominal work. I'm good with one weight. Full extension. Knees all the way up. Extend so that your lower back stays on the floor, yes? Let's go. What, 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 what does this button do? Think of a roly-poly as you come up. Turn your body into a tiny ball, yes? Cardio push, get ready, ready. 15 seconds. Woo. Good job. Rest. Take that weight carefully off the side. Make your way back up. Towel off, hydrate here. Walk it out, shake it out. Arms, legs, posture break. Squats, back kicks, obliques, rotations, mobility, yes. Quick finisher, a little bit more abs on the mat, and we'll call it a day, yes. All right, back kicks, upper body comes forward. Come up into a squat, upper body comes forward, kick back. You are alternating, yes? Take your time or kick it up. 30 seconds here. Oh yeah. Stretching, finishing off on the floor. So we're gonna go right back to the lower ab area with the option of using your weights. 10 seconds, you got it, come on. Mobility, more abs right here, opposite hand, opposite leg, all the way down, all the way up. You got it. Wrap up 10 seconds. Really use your abdominals and glutes, yes. Abs on your way down, glutes at the top, and time. All right, so if you're gonna utilize that weight, the challenge is you're gonna have to hold on to that weight a little bit tighter, yes? So once again, back onto your back, you're gonna bend those knees. Nice grip on the weight. So you're here. 
Once again, arms are to the side body. And then you're just gonna lift about one or two inches up, yes? Yes, definitely some trust issues here with the weight between the legs. You can always reposition here. Shoulder blades up and just lift the hips again, yes? Using your abs. Finish off, 10 seconds. Couple of deep stretches as we wrap up today's workout, yes? Good job, take that weight. Once again, in between the legs, off to the side. I'll meet you on your abs, yes? We're gonna go into a cobra stretch. Breathing in, exhale, open up. Any tightness in that back, come onto your forearms, breathing in, exhale, lengthen. Well done, yes? Lower down, breathing in. Exhale a little bit deeper into the stretch if you can. Checking in, shoulders relaxed. Roll back, gazing up. Beautiful. Yes, we got those fingers, toes, hips straight up. We're gonna go into a downward facing dog. You're on your mat, think about stretching out your mat. Right or left leg up, pick a side, right into pigeon here. Outer thighs, glutes, sit into it here. Gently rock side to side. So question, how many of you guys actually did today's workout or did you just sit and watch? And you're like, yeah, this workout, I'm gonna do it later, yes? Commit to it. If you did say later, yes, let me know when you end up doing it. Right back into that plank to your down dog. Opposite leg, bring it in. Right into pigeon, breathing in. Exhale, relax, nice and deep into the stretch. You can remain still, or if it feels good to do a little rock side to side, rock it out here. Or maybe you're like, hey, so-and-so would totally love this workout. Do not forget to share. It doesn't always mean sharing on your actual post. You can send this workout in someone's DM, text, finding our workouts, not just on Facebook, but on our YouTube channel, yes? All right, gonna go right back into that plank when you're ready, ready. Walk your hands to your feet. Take your time. Allow your upper body to relax here. Hamstring stretch. From here, walk your legs, feet out. Bend those knees. Deep inhale up. Exhale, sit on down, yes? Nice and low. So keep in mind, if you haven't done this before, maybe in a while, you might be sore. The beauty of today's 30 minute workout, you can always double up on the exercises, doing two full rounds. Carefully release, make it an hour, yes? Exhale, release, roll the shoulders, shaking out those legs. Yes, open up those hips. I appreciate you all joining me. I look forward to seeing you soon. As usual, you rock.